stare at a picture can unfold memories. Imagery is powerful to our memory and it takes real skill and art to take a perfect picture. On Mystery Unlocked today, we enter deep into the mind of award-winning African photographer Stephen Aduse. Hi, this is Stephen Aduse. I'm on Mystery Unlocked on Flash Africa. Shooting a yeah, 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 gallery, yeah. and uh, she's here right now. My collection today um, is a bit more bridal, a bit more whimsical, very fairy tale like, and I hope you all enjoy it. Photography is the best tool to restore memory. Yeah, I mean, when you look at the libraries or when you look back. You look, take your childhood pictures. That's all you have. Even if you have videos of it, I mean, you can't possibly. Sometimes you can't even watch the VHS anymore. But photography is still there that you know you can look at and restore your childhood memories. Photography, a creative art form that makes us remember blissful and mournful moments and adds to life's value, is currently a booming business worldwide. Many now have mastered the skill to live life through a lens. And one of such is award-winning African photographer, Stephen Edusei. Stephen hails from Ghana in the west coast of Africa. The photographer, over years, has strived to establish a successful brand, which is recognized worldwide. Stephen loves to shoot anything from humans to food, landscapes and any subject he deems interesting enough to be captured by his Canon professional system. The unusual becomes so many that it becomes the usual. I mean, you get to the event, you're about to start shooting and then the bride will ask you, um, are you doing video as well? So the bride actually thought they booked you and you're doing photo and video. So at that moment, you're standing there, no, I'm doing photos. So that, that's a bit unusual. So you're shooting the day knowing that they were actually expecting you to um, do video as well and you're not doing video. His art has a broad range. Stephen has worked on several projects which include the Glitz Lifestyle magazine. It is very important for the photographer to connect with the subject to get a very you know, perfect image. Because usually um, people are camera shy or people are shy when they don't know you or they react differently. They are not themselves when um, you're shooting them for the first time. Even sometimes the person you know so well, for the first time you start, it's not like they are not themselves. So it's very important for you to connect. You have to work that out so you're free with each other. Otherwise you're shooting someone who is trying to act or someone who is shy. Now the judges are <laughs> voting for this. So let's More work within this variation, something. Uh, so they're not taking photos. Okay. Location is very important. Uh, it's very crucial to the entire shoot. I look out for the theme, what we're looking for at the end of the day, the, the bigger picture. How do you want this picture to look like? What, are, what message are you sending across? Then we look for a location that, you know, depicts that. So if you're doing fashion and a very nice outfit that you want to shoot, it's either you're looking for contrast or you look for something else. So you actually scout and look for a location that will match whatever you're... But if you get wrong location, it's like you're sending two messages or you don't know what you're saying. In 2012, Stephen organized the workshop CAP, How to Shoot Like a Pro. This is a series of workshops that we, we've started. We're hoping to let people who are interested in um, photography, beginners or people who are looking to refresh, uh, get back into, you know, know exactly what they're doing when they pick up the camera. When you're shooting F60, you're getting more objects in focus. So if you use F16, then you're going to get a lot more. So the, the larger the number, which means the smaller the opening, the more you just stuff in focus. And I find that uh, class rather insightful. I've learned a couple of things and I'm looking forward to the next class. Every 
day up and coming photographer should have it in mind. Don't follow, don't follow the money yet. Learn. That's the only way coming successful. The money will come later.